Right, so before this video starts, I'd just like to say definitely hit that subscribe button because we are in a race with Tiri Lion to 500 subscribers. And I know we're on 43, but we can get there. We can beat him. And also, did you know that 76% of you watching this video are not subscribed? So go down there, press subscribe, and enjoy the video. So I'll be saving up for one of those, which will be a lot more useful than a laptop. But let's just give you a very quick overview. So I know I said 10 minute tour. Yeah, it's not going to reach 10 minutes because it's not that big a desk. But we'll manage it anyway. So underneath the desk here, they've got some supports just to keep it all up. But if I just take a very quick step back. There's not, it's not too bad for cables. As in obviously I've got a lot of electric stuff so it does all need to be plugged in. But that's all fine, I manage. Uh, obviously, cable management could be a little bit better, but that's totally fine. So, let's go over what's in this plug first. In this plug, you've got the plug for my TV with the green light on. And then, the other plug is just to charge my uh, tablet, USB-C. Uh, this big power breakdown is for the laptop. I'll get to that later. Big extension cord, fully maxed out. And then, working way down, we have the camera charger for the back. Well, not the camera charger, the battery charger for the camera which I'm using. The case, the two deodorants because I smell. And now my Xbox with a 500GB SSD on the top. That thing has loads of games on it. The memory stick that I use to put all my videos on. And then coming up, oh god. And moving on to the top shelf up here, we have just loads of random stuff. My old Xbox headset, my wallet. <laughs> Some random power cables. You just have stuff everywhere, don't you? A Rubik's cube that I can't solve. Bluetooth keyboard, my Galaxy Watch charger, and a speaker that I occasionally use. And then featured on the windowsill of dreams is a mash of cables, my keys, a wireless charger, not a wireless charger, a battery pack, my nan's old laptop which I'm trying to fix for her. Loads of bed stuff. A duster. And some grapes. <laughs> Horrible. But now we are onto the big boy stuff. We are onto the main desk setup and how I and how I basically do stuff. So we actually with the desk actually arrived yesterday. So everything was done either last night or this morning. And it's now eight o'clock in the morning and my leg hurts. Okay then so what I'll do is I'll get my laptop or our laptop, place it on here. I don't really mind how far back it goes. Plug this thing in, because this is the wireless for the keyboard. And I don't, I don't actually use the inbuilt. I used to, but I'm going to try and not use that anymore. I then plug the microphone in. Like that. And then on this side, there's two things that need to be plugged in. The power cable, just to give it the best performance possible for the longest amount of time. And then the HDMI cable. And then all I need to do is open it up, which uses two hands, one second. All I need to do is open it up. That will then turn itself on. And then with one press of the button around the side of the TV, with that, we just wait a few seconds. We have it up on both screens. And the best thing about this is that I have actually I've got two mount two mice. I've got one for gaming and then one which it just connects through the same connection 
as the uh, what's it called the keyboard so I think the TV is going to become my new sort of main screen with the laptop becoming my second but yet again my favourite thing to do is to just drag in between screens and obviously eventually I will be getting another monitor for this thing so there a monitor is going to go and just basically do everything and then just to finish over the desk tour you've got my microphone which has been featured in the review which is on 150 views at the minute which is insane you've got my controllers which are on charge at the minute but with the press of the button they come up and I can just take them off and use them to game and then switching to my Xbox on the TV I've not actually tried yet so this might be a bit weird but I'll just go down here I think I'll, I'll be the boot boy press that button Xbox. hey it's Xbox so now I can have, uh, let's say, just something random running on this screen and playing something on this screen. So obviously everything is a work in progress. Uh, whatever I do will be kept being upgraded. I'll just have a great. I'll also do a part two of this. I'll keep updating you, like every month or two months or so. This will come out as my in between videos because it's not that big. Uh, so I'm getting a new bookshelf soon as well, which is good because that one's tiny. You can hardly put any stuff on it. Thanks for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, then definitely smash the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!